welcome back, I think, to the Craft Beer Climbing channel. Obviously, it's been about three weeks, I think, since I've uploaded a video, of which I am very sorry about. We were focusing on the giveaway for the first week, and then the second week, we just kind of decided to take a week off, and then, then it turned into two weeks, and here we are. But enough of that, today we have an incredible review. And we're gonna keep this video short and sweet because we really want to just focus on the beer that I'm about to talk about. This is the review of the Arizona Wilderness Brewing Company, AZ Dream School Double IPA. Now this beer is probably one of the hardest, if not the hardest beer to get when it comes to Arizona Wilderness's repertoire of beers. Now this beer, again, is incredibly highly sought after, and if you're not in the valley and you don't manage to swing by the breweries when they have their limited quantity four packs, if you're not in the valley and you're not able to place your pre-order or pickup order for these four packs, and if you're not in the valley and not able to swing by the brewery and actually try it while they have it on tap, then you're pretty much so well. And this is, again, a beer that I've known about for the last two and a half, three years or so that I've been drinking craft beer and known about. Arizona Wilderness and I've just never been able to score myself a can or a four pack or gotten down to the valley when they've got it on tap. I'm always in the wrong place at the wrong time until today. So first and foremost I want to take it to thank this man right here. This is his Instagram handle. Go check him out. For taking it upon himself to send me some beer. Here we are. I'm about to review this beer and I could not be more excited. So please gather our thoughts. Hum. Hum. That's enough of that. Let's get the beer. And here we are. This is it. This is the beer that is almost impossible to get unless you are in Phoenix, Arizona, Gilbert, Tempe, you know, Phoenix metropolitan area when it is dropped by Arizona Wilderness Brewing Company. Now this is, as I already said, a double IPA. Um, it is called Dream School because it is made to replicate or imitate cream skull pops or cream pops um, or orange cream skull pops. It is brewed with Arizona lactose, Arizona oranges, and vanilla and citrus hops. So I have no questions whatsoever knowing everything that Arizona Wilderness can accomplish with all of these beers that they brew that this is going to be probably one of the best beers we've ever had. Okay, we're getting ahead of ourselves. Let's, let's, let's pour it up, shall we? Get this guy nice and pour it in there. Look at that color. I mean, it smells, it smells like, I mean, let me put it to you this way. If you were to take this up to a blind person and be like, here, smell this. Why a blind person would sound geriatric. This beer smells it advertised. It smells like vanilla. It smells like oranges. It smells like when you first peel open that wrapper of that orange cream school bar and you get that just punch of citrus and vanilla and cream and just This beer, I 100% understand why this is so hard to get. This is, this is, it, it tastes, it smells, and to be fair, it looks like what you'd expect a cream school to look like if it were to melt and be fizzy and in a beer glass. Thank you so much, Mr. Sean O'Malley's. Again, if you, I know I've got like, a dozen of you following me here on this or uh, on YouTube. Go check him out. Go, go, go show some love, spread some love, share some love, give him a follow. Uh, I, I literally, I didn't pay him for this. He gets nothing out of this except seeing me review the beer. And I just, I can't express my gratitude. This, this beer is just. It's something else. Have a great night. As always, climb hard, crush cans, repeat, drink responsibly, skull, cheers, prost, slante, 
uh, I freak, uh, the Storolia. Uh, yeah. Have a great night, guys. Thank you.